hi guys so this is my new video in which let me show you what i'm going to do now as you can see here uh, this is my type right currently i made it at as installation partner so automatically one task here will will be get done one open activity okay now the thing the scenario is only if installation partner will be there then only this activity will come okay else you know if it will be prospect no such action will be performed so based on that now i'm going to write my program what to do first let me delete this one cool now here what, what the first thing okay ah. let me start it now guys uh, what i'm doing here in account i'm writing this program so i give some name okay and it is after update means <clears throat> means after once it will only fire once it will get updated so now what i have to do here i just click if trigger dot is after operation keep and let me keep one more if so should be trigger dot is update these for the basic prerequisites once this will get set now guys the thing is something like this uh, i told you that task i need to do right so for that i need to create one array of that so it should be task i give some name maybe task to update equal to new and it should be array format something like that. then copy this yeah all will be get set now i need to iterate them so for that what i will do i will create one account variable so account a comma and whatever this will be there it will be for any new one so it should be trigger dot new got my point guys in case if you think this will be little fast so you can check my previous video in which i explain all these thing in details now once it will be get set means all the trigger new trigger will be stored into a so now on words a is the caretaker of everything now let me give one one more condition guys if what will happen what we want uh, for example let me open this one okay now now here i didn't make we want that trigger type right this type should be the new one should be prospect correct i'm sorry the new one should be installation uh, yeah it it will be something like this trigger dot id or better trigger dot type trigger dot type equal to is double equal to hmm. this is a new one we talking about the new one what we need installation partner okay so should be 
solution. Let me check on the spelling. So what my requirement is, my new account type should be this. And if I talk about my new one, it should be uh, also know what was the old one supposed to be. So a dot, get some space, yeah, a dot, trigger dot old map dot get in get you have to give your ID dot type equal to double equal to it is prospect, right? Yeah. Prospect. So basically what I'm doing here, if my updated account type is installation partner and my old account type, I know this is little new for you. So let me brief you. Trigger dot old map is nothing but previously one the mapped one okay in that get method we are using means whatever previously will be stored we need to fetch it how we will fetch it only based off ID ID of what account ID so a dot ID I used okay so all will, they will fetch and then they will check their type if their type is prospect means in short the in your account the the previous value was prospect and if the and if the new value is equal to this installation partner then only this operation will perform okay now what's the operation nothing just go for create one task object task t equal to new task cool now in this one you can provide additional informations <clears throat> sorry like uh, you want some name right so let me give some name for that maybe subject mm. it should be mm, my first task so basically whenever the new task will when the new task will be get made certainly this its name should be my first task with that name it should pop up in open activity and because we passing it's a parameter we should give one comma similarly we need to provide owner ID as well owner id what is the owner id sir we need the owner id what is there in account so for that who's the caretaker of account correct it's variable a so a dot owner id okay last thing what id If uh, those who don't know what is that, what ID is. So let me tell you what ID is nothing but the object ID. Okay. Basically all the account and opportunity ID will comes under this. This is an even, this is an one of the interview question. Tell me the difference between what ID and who ID. Okay. 
now here what id i will give a dot id and yeah comma i need to give let me check any error no okay so this will be So this will finish off this if else, sorry, if and this will be finish off for once both of them will done. Next thing we need to add this to list, right? List of array that I made here. So what I will do, I will just call this one dot add method. And inside that, I just need to pass this T. Okay, some error popped up. Let me check. What's the error? Line number 22 okay okay guys so just nothing but this one once this will be get done let me paste this and save okay so it's, uh, it's successfully deployed in my org perfect any additional thing I have to do keep by keeping a good practice what additional I can do is let me give this one task to update okay I just want to keep like if it's size method is greater than zero okay then I need to perform this. Then I need to insert. Let me save it. Cool, done. So this is my trigger. Let me check whether it's working or not. So let me create one account. Okay, account name. I give some. And right now, the type first I will give prospect. Remember the moment it will be prospect, no search open activity should be there. So let me save it. Okay. Now, if you can see in this open activities, it's not showing anything, right? Now, once instead of prospect, if it's changed to installation okay then one task will be come with this name my first task okay let me try it
okay guys you can see one task is there so this perfectly showed that our epic trigger is working okay thank you for watching video and yeah guys now comment section is active kindly give you valuable comments on that and even i i added my instagram id so if any if any one of you having any additional queries or any kind of advice or any kind of questions doubts which you have and you would like to share with me so kindly follow me in instagram and dm me in instagram okay that's all from my side i'm vikas kumar signing off